Hey everyone, welcome to TechScale and today's video is going to be very different where uh, I'll not be talking about a specific device or something but I would like to talk about a new browser and its new features that were launched today, right? So you must have heard about the browser company. They have built an amazing browser uh, right from scratch on Chromium Engine that is the Arc browser. If you can see, this is the uh, browser here. This is the icon of the browser Arc, right? And today they have launched some of the new features some of the new features that are nowhere available in any browser as such right so i would like to talk about the new features today because they were launched and later i will explain how and what browser companies maybe in another video right uh this might be a little unconventional but this is how uh, i'll be doing it right so for example if you're in a browser you why do we come to the browsers right maybe to search something maybe to uh, surf internet right let's say i want to uh, see a recipe of uh, this is a famous indian dish shahi paneer right so i'll click on this and this will pop up few recipes right so now if you want to know more about any uh, particular link what this link brings you in other browsers you will have to click here and you will go to this particular page and look for the recipe but in our browser you don't have to do that all you have to do is go to the uh, link and just hover on it as soon as you hover on it arc browser will generate a precise information that what this particular link brings to you how amazing is that right similarly for example if i uh, go here you will see a little uh, bit of information is generated uh, with this page how i identify is uh, probably they visit this page and then uh, a chat gpt kind of thing runs on it and they generate this precise information right this is how it does but this is super useful uh if you are in the arc browser or if you want to use this uh, feature you should definitely check out the arc browser right let's say i search in a, uh, something else how to become a full stack developer right i'll search this and again couple of like a lot of links are coming up but i don't know what to visit right maybe i don't have that amount of time that i should just go and start uh reading each uh link in side by side right so what i'll do is i'll simply hover on it it will automatically generate some information for me right some useful information so that at least now i have i have a fair idea what this particular website brings to me right now you can say i can read and until the time i reach the more content will be generated this is one of those amazing features right another feature that our browser brings to us as let's say i'm on amazon right maybe i am uh, searching something maybe another thing is here another thing is here another link is opened here or maybe i'm looking for cases for one plus eight pro i have the phone that i'm currently using right so i'll open this in new tab again open this in new tab because we do this right we do <coughs> this kind of things now there are a couple of pages here right you can say i'm i'm, I'm pretty not sure what this particular page uh, brings right so what i'll do is i'll simply drag this to the pinned section as soon as i bring it you will see our browser will rename it for me again if i bring this here our browser will again rename this for me which is one plus eight cover if i again bring this you see our browser is renaming the tab for me and if i don't want what our browser does did for me i'll simply double click and i can rename the tab here how useful it is now i know what exactly this tab is no uh, default title for the tab is here now but this is one of the amazing feature that our browser is bringing us to now another feature that uh, our browser bought in brought in this particular update is the new chat gpt in the command tab right so we will go to command tab by clicking con uh, command t right and simply we will type chat gpt and hit tab now whatever i what do you know about the arc browser so as soon as i hit this you can see you can automatically uh see uh, search this in chat gpt i don't have to go to the website and do all sort of stuff it is built right inside the browser right how now the question is how can i access these features i'm very sure that a lot of you people are already using uh our browser but you don't have those features with you right what you have to do is you have to go to command uh, any page you click on command t and then you search max it will say open max preferences when you click on this 
this is how the page looks like right now you have uh, this thing open for most of the people it will be turned off that means all of these things will be off so uh, you will have to turn all of them on or anyone or whatever you uh, want to turn on you can do it here another thing that I miss telling you is uh, keeping the downloads tidy now what is uh, tidy downloads I will tell you for example I want to save this picture right and save image and I'll save it here as soon as I saved it right this was what the initial name of the image was but uh browser the arc browser automatically renamed it to spygen one plus eight location on jpg because now if i go to my downloads folder i will know what exactly this image is another example maybe i will go to another page okay let's um, open this thing now i would simply save this particular image i will click on this and i will save right initially this is the name and if i go to the downloads i have no idea what this thing is right i'll click on save the arc browser will automatically rename it for me it will it renamed it to solima one plus eight pro cover gpg right now if i go to the downloads folder i will easily see it right you can see this thing is here right now i know what thing is what this is another feature so another thing that uh, is here uh, now is the ask feature so the ask on page so what you have to do is you have to click on option and f sorry control and f whenever you uh you, you read it here find or ask right so i'll check does the phone cover uh do its job or bad english i'll write is this phone cover good and i'll click on ask automatically uh, it says this page was long so i read the 51 percent so it automatically went to the customer section uh, customer review section it reads few of those things and now i can i don't have to go down and check specific things uh this browser does it by default so this is one of the like, amazing feature that they have rolled out today so again if you want to know how to uh, enable this particular thing you uh, click on control t and you search max preference or sorry you search max and you will click on open mac preferences and from here you can uh, toggle on or off to these particular things if you don't want to turn all of the features you can specifically turn on one feature right and turn off the other maybe according to your preference you may not like one or you may not like the other so you can do it what i like all of them so i'm keeping it on so that is uh, what new things the browser company has introduced in the art browser in the latest update right that's all for this video and if you have more and more questions regarding our browser you can directly uh put a comment down to this video or you can hop onto the telegram channel where we can discuss it right? the link of both is in i mean the telegram channel is in the description that's all for this video and i will see you in the next one till then i think i am totally loving that browser art browser is as awesome so yeah that's it that's it for this video i will see you in the next one bye, -bye.